Hi ho, everybody! I'm Nathan Blake. This game called Beasts and Beasts. Uh huh. We're gonna play it today. We're gonna play it. I say we're gonna play this game right now. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Alright, so this is Beasts and Beats, and I don't know very much about it other than that you are playing as some sort of queen that is fighting in a musical dungeon using her trumpet of musical power to defeat enemies, but I don't know how that, any of that works. Ah, I like it though. Man, this is good. It's got a beat. It's a really good beat. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, hello. Ah, oh, okay, I'm assuming I want to jump over these. I'm just gonna jump over them right here right now Right here right now. I say I'll jump over them today Come on <laughs> Yes, oh my gosh look at that horse. Oh, he's so delightful. All right, Crojan. How's it going my friend? I am here to fight you It's whoa whoa whoa, okay Okay, I'm too close. I'm too close. Oh, man, gosh. Oh, boy. Okay, ah, uh, I'm going down. Because I'm still figuring out how this game even works. But, man, this is good music. He looks like James Baxter from Adventure Time. <laughs> oh, man, this game makes you feel good about getting your butt kicked. Because the music is just... So good. Oh boy. Okay, I thought I had time to get through there. Oh, there's a sprint button. No wonder. Oh boy, I'm messing it up. I was just gonna try to just sprint through and see what happened, but you, you literally can't do that if you want to live. All right, let's see what this guy does. What's up, the juggernaut? Whoa, okay. He's just gonna come at me. He gonna come at me, bro! Okay, I can handle this one way better than the horse, from what I could tell, because the horse moves so unpredictably. I'm sure I could get the handle of the horse eventually, but even the horn's starting to play into the music a little bit. It's pretty cool. Ah! Uh, get it! Ah! Uh. I really, really dig this. Like, it's hard to make good commentary because I'm just jamming out, man. Oh, yeah, keep it up. Whoever made this game, you have done a fantastic job because even, even if the mechanics, which the mechanics seem pretty decent, even if the mechanics are not good, you've got such a good aesthetic here that I don't even care. It's just like, I just want to be in this world that you've created because... Oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> so with this guy, pretty much it's just a make sure you're always strafing sort of thing. And that pretty much does it because he can't he can't really keep up with you if you stray. Oh, the beat dropped! Oh! No! Poop bears! I can't believe I messed that up. Okay, so we've almost got him, and I've got a pretty good sleek strategy now down. Yeah, we got him. Yeah, so a big part of his was... Ooh, music dropped again. big part of his was making sure you were close to him when he hit the wall. So really, you just let him swing past you while you were up against the wall, more or less. Woo! Okay, boy. Oh, boy! Okay, well, we bounced all the way over here. And then, yeah, you just hit him whenever he was up against the wall. And what is this room? Oh, I like this. Okay, this this room is different from the other interim rooms. It doesn't seem to have anything going on with it really, but we got this guy We got this guy. He is jamming out. Yo, he's he's ready to go. What's up, man? What's up? What's up? Oh Okay, well, what do we have in here? Banshee Okay, I'm assuming that that's Banshee, and that I shoot her to deal that. Oh, she gonna be, oh, whoa, whoa, where is she? The heck is she? Oh, her bullets go through things. Okay, good to know. But man, they got a good beat. 
Come on, Banshee. I need you to move in a little closer, because from, from that distance, I have trouble hitting you with very much of my spread, my trumpet shotgun spread. And you gotta admit, easier to hit me when you're close to me, right? So, if I had to classify this game, I would call it Rhythm Bullet Hell First Person Shooter. <laughs> it's good. I like it. Yeah, it makes you want to sing and dance. Makes you want to talk in rhythm, you see. It makes you want to go all around and be really good at the game and at dropping the beat and at doing all the things that you say and you want to see. Ooh. I don't want to die. Please, don't kill me. That would be a pain right now. I don't need to die right now. I'd like to stay alive right here and keep playing the game and dodging the songs. All I need to do is just keep on going through all the moves that I need to dodge all that you see. Oh. So she's singing at us, whereas the other ones were doing things like playing music at us, or dropping the beat. As long as you follow the music, you're pretty much okay. It's all in the rhythm, the rhythm of the game. You just gotta keep on moving and grooving and see what you can do. Jump on through. Show them all what you can do. Ooh! Our gun is really not very accurate, but I suppose a, a trumpet shotgun wouldn't be. Doesn't seem like the most accurate of instruments, you know? If I had to pick an accurate instrument, it would be like the recorder or something, because it's like a it's like a dart gun. It's the dart gun of the musical world, you know? Maybe a violin as it's got a bow. <laughs> Small and accurate and it has a bow. Since it's fretless, you have to know exactly what you're doing, you know? You can't you can't miss with a violin or it sounds terrible. So if you're a good violinist, then you're a good shot. Boom! Oh yeah. Let's take it all back. Let's show the horse who's boss. Now that we've learned how to play the game. Now that we know how to put him to shame. Only one guy left to show who's boss, and that's him. Let's do it. I like how this room seems to kind of show you the kind of thing you're going to have to do when you reach the next room and you fight the horse. All right, man, bring it on. Unfortunately, I got super close to him early on in the fight last time, and it's all about keeping a distance between you and him. I also didn't know where my gun was accurate or how to use it accurately before, but I think I have a pretty good feel for it now. Ah, still not going to get this on my first try, I don't think. As long as you don't hit the front of it, you're okay. So if you can get on top of it, ah, boom! Poop bears. Poop, 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 poop bears. Let's poop, do it. Poop, poop. I poop like bears. how this room seems to kind of show poop, you. Poop, poop, the poop kind bears. Of thing you're I going said, to have to do. Poop, poop, poop. When you poop reach bears. the next Get room there. and you fight poop, the horse. Poop, poop. Show All right, man. Who's boss? Bring I got on. a lot of things to do. I got a lot of things to say. I got other games to play. So let's get it over with. I'll show this horse just who he, I am, and he will regret his decision to pull. Ah! <laughs> I'm not good. Fortunately, I'm bad at this game. I was better at the others, but I don't think I could do this one. Ah, too bad. Sing it. Sing it. Just get on with it. Uh-huh. Let's Sing do it. it. Poop, poop. Let's I like go. this room seems to kind of show Sing you. It. Poop, 
poop. Poop. Uh -huh. thing you're I going said, to have to do. Ow, I got poop. hit. Poop. By poop. that there. piano. And and I don't really know poop. what I'm right, doing. Man. Who's boss? Bring I got a lot of things. All right, we've got him under half health. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to get him. He just... My gun's so inaccurate. He gets so close so often. Always oh, shooting music now. Poop. <sighs> Come on! No! Uh, he's like a combination of him and the Banshee now. No, oh, I jumped too early! Oh! Let's sing it! Poop, poop, poop. Uh, let's go! Uh, seems to kind of sing it! Poop, poop, poop. <laughs> poop. Uh -huh. bear thing you're I going said, to have to do. Now I got poop. hit poop. Poop. by poop. that piano. Okay. I don't let's really go. know poop. what I'm right, doing. Man. Who's boss? I got a lot of things. Just spray and pray. Ah! Uh, can't believe I let him get get me on that. He wasn't even that close. No! Oh. Get away from me! I got him! Woo! Yes! Oh my gosh, I did it! Oh! Ah, it's too hot in this room. Uh, I've been going for more than half an hour now. Ah, my hand hurts. I'm a big baby. Oh. <laughs> Next show is Furia the Queen versus the Court of Music. Okay. Well, this has been Beasts and Beats. This is a really good game. This is super well done. I would play an entire game of this with sub dungeons and, and, and smaller. Ah, excuse me. With sub dungeons and and smaller enemies and and bigger bosses and way more going on and puzzles and ah, oh, but so good, I love it. Uh huh. Thank you so much to whoever made this game. I'm serious. This is art. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching. I really enjoyed this game. Everything about it is wonderful. Uh, I would uh, maybe suggest making it a little more clear where our trumpet actually shoots because it took me a while to realize that it hits left of center quite a bit. Um, but anyway, thank you all so much for being here. And uh, as always, I will see you in the next one. For now, this is Nathan Blake signing off for Nathan Blake Games. Remember, the games are art and art is important. Sayonara!